Hello everybody, welcome to the video section of our Launch Metrics Support Center. Today we're going to be covering how to create a new sample collection. Prior to any successful sample import, the collection, consisting of designer name, collection name, and season, must be created in the system beforehand. Hopefully at this point you might have already learned and watched our previous support videos on how to uh, log into your launch metrics site as well as navigate to samples. If not, please refer to those videos. To create the collection, I'm going to hover over my samples tab and I'm going to click on collection editor. In the collection editor, this is where I'm going to have the ability to search and view previous collections that have already been created within the system. If a collection that you're looking to create has already been created in the system, there's no need to create that collection once again. By clicking on Create Collection, this is how I'll start the process. I'm faced with uh, a series of red asterisks, which means that these fields are required. Designer, Collection, and Season are required when creating a new collection. When I'm filling out my designer field, if I start to type in a designer name that does not exist, no results found, I know that I need to go ahead and create that designer. So to do that, I can do it directly from this window and by clicking on the plus icon. Now I can create my designer The collection name, because you're creating a new collection, um, you'll probably see that it will also say no results found, but that's okay because I'm creating my collection for the first time. If you are creating a new collection that's been used before, such as a RTW, ready to wear, um, when, so you type, once you start to type that in, you might see that populate. So feel free to just go ahead and click on that if you see that within your launch metric system. For season, um, this would be where you would put in your season. So if I try to create SS18, I might see no results found. That means that that season had not been created yet. So again, to take care of that, you'll click on the plus icon and click on add. In my season code, this is where I would select SS. As you can see, there's numerous season codes um, that you can select and then the year as well. So now I've fulfilled everything that has been read and required to create a new collection. I filled out my designer, collection, and season. You're also able to put in retail stockist information um, to find where that to make note of where the, this collection can be found um, in local retail stores. So now I'm going to click on create and then if I click on search, I now see that I have put in place my collection. Please stick around and look for our future support videos on how to create samples using Excel as well as creating samples in bulk and one by one. Thanks for watching this video on creating new collections.